And welcome back. Now, President Uhuru Kenyatta has today asked the next government to conserve Nairobi National Park, considering that it is the only park in the world that is found in a city. However, the president has also asked the relevant stakeholders to align to new approaches which are in line with the changing socioeconomic and environmental realities such as climate change and the ballooning human population. Chapter Boyd now reports. President Uhuru Kenyatta has asked the next government to maintain Nairobi National Park as it is the only park in the world located in the heart of a city. The park has received an additional 2,000 acres of land and now sits on 37,000 acres of land. With the country's population projected to hit 100 million by 2063, the head of state has challenged conservation stakeholders led by the Ministry of Tourism and Kenya Wildlife Services KWS to innovate in new models of preserving Kenya's flora and fauna resources. And as Nairobi has grown, this park has remained a place where residents and our international visitors can engage with nature against the backdrop of a bustling metropolis. But it is critically important that we also collectively raise awareness, not just on the serious effects of wildlife crime, but also highlight the need to secure wildlife habitats. However, the park has had enough controversies in the recent years as some Kenyan question the value of the park. Tourism Cabinet Secretary Najib Balala last year revoked the appointment of Pauline Njoroge as member of the Tourism Regulatory Authority Board following a public outcry after it emerged that she had once questioned the economic value of the park being in the city. However, in his speech today, Tourism CS Najib Balala has thanked President Uhuru Kenyatta for his continued support in the sector. We have 23 national parks in the country, only seven are viable that make money for, the, for KWS. Also helping us to do the National Wildlife Sensor that was historical again for the first time ever done in this country. President Uhuru Kenyatta was speaking during the commemoration of the park's 75th anniversary since it was gazetted in 1946. Chapter Boit, Switch TV.